Hey everyone, welcome to From the Depths. I'm Enti and this is episode 6 of the No Hold Bar Tournament. This episode we've got the Dumbo by Drava, which we've seen in a previous episode, so we won't go a whole lot into that, even though I don't think we were able to see a whole lot because of its compact design, against the Go Away Mark II by Kneecap. Let's go ahead and fix the textures here. Looks like it's a... It's got two six-barrel miniguns. I believe it's a Graviton Ram using a uh, vessel. Uh, it's got some, these are some really big advanced cannons. Probably very powerful. Will uh, not go well if this gets penetrated, but it does have heavy armor on it, so that's probably not going to be very likely. Um, if it does have Graviton rams and rounds in there and it detonates, it's going to send itself careening all over the place. Yep, though, that's, that's Graviton ram. That is definitely Graviton ram. Uh, some repair bots, surge protectors on a wooden ship, but okay. <laughs> And then heavy armor, got some propulsion in the back there. Heavy armor on the front and back. Not on the side though. Weak on the side. Uh, it's got some ERA there, probably to protect the magazines from uh, detonation via heat. It's really all they do. Oh, it does have some more upside down propellers in the front for a little more turning authority. So it probably, probably has a very tight pivot turn almost. Since it doesn't have a whole lot of propulsion. Oh, it's got these prop props in the back. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, it's on the front, too. Downward facing props. Okay. Well, we will see what happens exactly here. I think the dr uh, the, uh, the Dumbo is going to have a little trouble with those Graviton Ram Rounds since it doesn't have any shields. Uh, but it does have the advantage of being a thruster craft, which are notoriously hard to actually hit. And if it does get hit, it, the go away will definitely. Up oh, there it goes. And it's gone. It is out of range now. Okay. It needs to return to range. Within the 60 seconds. I know this decision was uh, very uh, polarizing with some people, but uh, otherwise there's no point to the Graviton Ram Rams. This is what they do. This is literally the only thing they can do. Oh, and it is flipping over and exposing its uh, underside. It could end up getting itself AI deaded or something. The laser is uh, plinking away at it from that distance. Oh, jeez! <laughs> this thing. It's kind of amusing. Yeah, the Dumbo is getting uh, close to getting back in range. But I don't think it's going to make it in time. It's got 10 seconds. No, it's not going to make it to in range in time. Yep, nope, that, that's it. The, the Dumbo has been out of range for too long, and it will be disqualified. Forced disqualification by the Graviton Ram Rounds of the Go Away. Like, I know some people don't like that because they feel that it's not uh, right to punish a ship for a maneuvering decision that it did not make itself. But at the same time, if you don't, if I don't allow that, it's the same as banning the Graviton Ram Rounds, which was uh, kind of the opposite of what this tournament was supposed to be about. I want Nick and the other developers to see how broken things are, including the Graviton Ram Rounds, so they fix them. Because, I mean, if it wasn't... If there was... If I had done, made a map that had land masses, like if I had made an actual ring, the Dumbo would have been annihilated by crashing into the walls. So I don't see what the difference there is between disqualifying it or it getting rammed into a wall. The only difference is I didn't have to spend however long it would take to build a, to build a wall for it to crash into. So, yeah, we will get uh, round two here underway. See if the Dumbo can uh, avoid the shots a little better. Maybe get some hits off that uh, save its skin. And if it had some shields up, there it goes. It's gone. It is out of range. So the go away needs to make a good faith effort to close the distance with its opponent. 
And if it doesn't do that, yeah, as of right now, it's not doing that, so I'm not going to start the 60 second clock. Because it needs to be closing the range too. And it was doing that before in the first one. And it looks like it's starting to do so on this one, so I'm gonna go ahead. Jeez, oh. I think it just Graviton rammed itself and made it jump forward. Okay, I will start the 60 second clock now. Because now the, uh, the go away is making a good faith effort to approach its opponent. It's having a little trouble with it because its recoil is. Oh, and there goes the Dumbo again. But as long as it, uh... Oh, that was an overheat clunk. Yeah, it is, it is still trying to move towards its opponent, and it is successfully doing so, so... The clock will continue. And it's, uh... Getting down to the last, uh, like, 30 seconds or so here. Or no, 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 no. No, I'm sorry. That was the first, when I first looked at the clock. That's it. The, uh, the Dumbo is disqualified. It has been, it has been ringed out by the go-away. <laughs> Though the go-away is sinking because it is getting plinked by the lasers. Uh, if, the, if the Dumbo had just some really basic shielding on the front of it, this would be a completely different battle. So, I know it's a... it's a. Uh, some people aren't happy with my decision how I'm handling that, but I'm sorry, that's just... That's just the way it is. Uh, normally I ban Graviton Ram Rounds, because they are broken in OP, but I didn't want to, to do that for this tournament, and there's no other way for them to win. And like I said, there's no difference in the Dumbo being just unable to return to the fight and it being slammed into a wall and exploded. Like, either way, the go-away wins. So... Yep, that's it, folks. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you on the battlefield.